Welcome back. Do you need help understanding social distancing? Well, we are here to help. Our reporter, Steve Spangler, from our sister station in Denver, came up with an interesting way to explain it. He used mouse traps and ping pong balls. Take a look for yourself. By now, everyone knows what social distancing means, but as a scientist, I was thinking about it as a, a chain reaction and thinking of it as a model. How can I show this and what that are not that they're talking about? What one person who's infected now affects three and those three infect three, and what does that chain reaction look like? And to model this, I'm just using a, a simple little mouse trap. So I took a mouse trap and I hooked a cap onto it like this. So I just took a cap, hooked it on, and that cap is perfect to hold on to a ping pong ball. So, oh, scary. So this now is where the ping pong ball sits. I just did this in an aquarium down here with 45. So there's 45 ping pong balls on traps ready to go. And there's two more to add in. You just don't even want to breathe on it at this point. You just don't want it to trigger early. All right. Now this piece of plexiglass goes on top. All right. Okay, so in our example, we want to drop in one infected ping pong ball, so to speak. One triggers one, next one, and I want you to see what happens. Here we go. Three, two, one. Look at this. I think almost all of them triggered. So now let's do the same thing, but you just use an example of social distancing. Here's what social distancing looks like now with the mousetrap example. I've spaced them out. I've only put 10 of them in here. We started with 45. There's a little space in between each one. The idea is how quickly will one transmit to the next and the next when you put a little space in between. All right, here we go. Three, two, one. Oh my gosh, look at this. One, two, three, four, five of them left over. Not a bad example of what happens when we practice social distancing. What an interesting and simple way to explain it. Again, social distancing six feet away from each other. Please stay home. I know a lot of this is out of our control, but what we have, we can control, is staying home and take it seriously. Right, Eric?